haste termination, it's ready. So the IQ-78 has just been released. So we're here at the ITRC with this and five other um, urethane bowling balls that are very popular from Storm. So we're going to throw all of them today and see how they compare and match up to the IQ-78. Let's do it. So that was a perfect shot there on five. I'm going to throw a couple more shots there and then I'm going to move five left. Sound was a little high, but it still got the job done. Okay, so I threw a couple shots on five, now I'm gonna move over to 10, and then later we're gonna do the same thing with 15 and 20. So that was another great shot on 10, we're just gonna try and repeat that again. Okay, so now that I've thrown a couple shots on 5 and 10, I'm going to move over to 15. So as I'm moving farther and farther left, the ball is encountering less friction, so it's going to be a little more difficult uh, to get the ball across the boards, but we're going to throw a couple more shots. So after this shot, we're going to move our way over to 20. Okay, so we're going to take a couple more shots on 20 before wrapping up the video. So this is actually a pretty good way to figure out um, your line in just regular practice, like playing on each dot. So I'm gonna throw a couple more shots on 20. I'm gonna throw another shot on 20 and then we're gonna move even further left. Now we're going to move our way over to 25 now. So as you can see, I've had pretty decent success with every dot that I bowled with this ball. So I'm going to throw a couple more shots on 25. So I'm just going to try and replicate that last shot. Okay, just for fun, I'm going to throw one final shot super far left before wrapping up the video.
So now we got the pitch black. It's got a higher RG compared to the 78, which means that it should go a little longer down the lane. So let's throw some shots today. So that one hit the pocket pretty well, but it kind of deflected a little bit. So now I'm going to move five left over to 15 and throw some more shots with it. So I like that one much better. It got into a much better roll phase and it hit the pocket pretty well. So now we're gonna move on to the fast pitch. This ball has an RG even higher than both the pitch black and the 78. So it should go even longer than both of the balls that we've already thrown. So it went longer but snapped back very well. It kind of deflected a little bit, but with the urethane that can happen sometimes. So I got that one out a little wide too, but we got a nice break there. So now I'm gonna move left and take three more shots on 15. We got a nice light mixing strike there. So I'm gonna try and do something similar, maybe get the ball a little more flush into the pocket. So it's pretty much a perfect shot. You can't really ask for something much better than that. So I'm going to take one final shot with the fast pitch, and then we're going to move on. Okay, so next up we got the IQU. This has the same RG and differential as the IQ78. In fact, the only difference is the cover stock, but it can still change a lot about how the ball moves. So let's throw some shots with it. I'm going to throw one more shot, and then, as usual, we're going to move over to 15. So that one caught some friction early, but that's okay. Now we're going to move over to 15. So next up we got the IQ Red. If you haven't heard of this, it's because it is actually overseas. So you might not have heard of it. But it also has the same RG and differential as the IQ 78. The only difference between the cover stocks similar to the IQU. So let's throw some more shots with it. Now we're going to move over to 15 now. So that's going to wrap up the video today. Uh, as you just saw, I played from 5 all the way over to 30, and I still had decent success with pretty much everywhere that I threw this ball. So if you want to pick up your own, be sure to visit your local VIP Bro Shop. Uh, thanks to the ICRC for letting us shoot this video here today. Uh, thanks for watching, and blow up a storm.